Every time the F2000 powers on, Epson's created a power on clean. Now, it's a medium clean, it's on your white channels only, but it consumes about 18 milliliters of white ink. So that equates to $6.84. And we've found you really don't need to do a medium clean, you do need to perform at least one white clean, which consumes two milliliters of white ink or 76 cents. So I wanna show you how to turn the feature off. So basically what we wanna do is we wanna go into our main menu, and that would be on the right arrow. And we're going to go down to printer setup. We're going to go power on cleaning, the white ink, and we're just going to turn it off. At this point, we're done. We, just, we can just exit out of the menu. I'm going to go ahead and power this off at the same time. And we'll turn it back on to show you the new menu or the new display. Now, it's real important that every time you turn this system on, when this feature is turned off, you want to make sure you recover your white ink channels, whether you're using white ink for the day or not. As long as there's white ink in the system, you will need to recover your channels. What happens is every now and then, if you don't recover your channels, the head, either way, when you're printing, the head's going to move over and it's going to spit. Whenever your white channels aren't recovered, it's going to be spitting dry air, which could essentially dry your print head and cause print head failure. So it's really critical that if you turn this feature off, you want to make sure you are always performing the light clean to recover your white channels. And you'll know that by after you're doing your, doing your white clean, you would perform a nozzle check and make sure all your channels are on the nozzle check. So what we want to do is when we powered on, it just tells me the power on cleaning is off and it performed head cleaning if required. And again, with your white channels, you're going to want to make sure that that is performed. So we just hit OK. So at this point, what we would do is we would either go into the menu here or the maintenance and go to the maintenance section and we're going to go to uh, head cleaning right here and we're going to go to selected nozzles. Choose the white channels only, and we're going to do a light clean. Again, this is going to perform uh, a clean that consumes 2 milliliters of white ink instead of 18. And so as soon as this is finished uh, completing its cycle, once again, we would just perform a nozzle check right on the platen to confirm that the white ink is in fact recovered.